Hi YouTube, welcome back to the channel. Today I will show you how to solve the battery that a DJI battery was clocked completely when we change the battery cell. It's useless completely because at the time, all smart on of the DJI battery were equipped lock chip. When the chip recognize that the cell was replaced, it will lock immediately. The structure helps recognize the battery replacing, that is, the chip will monitor the voltage. When we pick the cell out, lost voltage, lost power supply, it will know that they are interfering the original battery cell, it will lock. If you can clever supply a parallel power continuously when replace the battery cell, it can have ability to cheat the chip. It cannot recognize the cell is picking out, then we put the new cell but unfortunately, when it's not power, when we get a battery out or not supply parallel power continuously and pick the cell out directly, it will lock absolutely. At the time, even small generations such as Mavic Mini, Mini 2, Mini SE, DJI equipped this chip even. It's not easy like the previous period. So you guys must pay attention on this. If unfortunately be locked, this is the solution. About the hardware, we need an equipment that's called EV2300. We can buy on AliExpress with 91 bucks. After have this equipment, we connect to motherboard. In case of Mavic Pro battery, we tear down and pay attention three pole, RAW, SDA, and SCL. We need the three pole to unlock. It equip have three Y. We will to three pole on the battery motherboard. Black to RAW, yellow to SDA, Violet to SCL. Okay, now we install the control software with namely UBRT2300. Okay, we open its recognized battery. We click on status register. We click read. Look at operation status too. This is the reason. PF is pink now. That means permanent file function is active by the lock chip. Now we tap unseal to modify. Okay, so set unseal. We click clear PF. Now we check, click read, state that it ring now, we just need to click seal, okay done, perfect. Okay with Mavic Air battery, it's a little bit different. We plug the connection directly right here, exact this order, black, white, brown. We use another software that is TRB, Battery Repairment Tool. We look at Advanced Tool, click PQ Tool. We click Unseal to modify. On PQ Tool, we click on FAS key. Okay, perfect. It's work now. We just need to tap Seal. Okay, thanks for watching. If you see the clip helpful, don't hesitate to click like, share, and can subscribe my channel in the clip. Bye-bye. See you next time.